Countdown to Mardi Gras on, and we're just now 32 days away uh, from Fat Tuesday. I cannot believe it's going to be here in 32 days. Wow, we're doing something just a little bit different this year on the WWL Morning News. We're so excited to bring this series to you, highlighting some of the bands that make Carnival season really what it is. Leah McNeil has the best assignment this morning. She's joining us now live from Fountain Blue High School. And look at that crowd behind you, didn't, girl. Didn't you say she was going to grab a flag? She and told me she was going to do something, so I'm going to hold her to it. <laughs> Listen. Some one of these ladies is going to show me some moves, but let's not let, let's not jump too far ahead of ourselves here. As y'all mentioned, they showed out this morning. I mean, good morning, y'all. Hello, good morning. Give me some noise. Yeah, there we go. We are here at Fountain Blue High School, the Crimson Marching Band. If y'all missed them at the top of the show, they will be playing again because y'all missed a treat. Joining me now to talk a little bit more about what goes into all this is their band director. 22 years you've been here, Mr. Hicks. What goes into getting all this? this <laughs> lots of hard work and preparation on the students part and uh, parental support and administration support from the school it, and the kids putting everything they've got into it to give energy and bring energy on the street to prepare for Mardi Gras and a lot of uh, endurance absolutely and I mean you know the drum line they played the whole time and I asked some of your students when we talked earlier this week who's the best band on the North Shore they said Fountain Blue you said everybody's great do you still stand by that of course but, you know, we do. We have outstanding music teachers on this North Shore, and we have the, the parish, and I'm uh, proud of all of them. So, but we're, we're happy to lead the way. I'll, I'll just put it that way. <laughs> Absolutely. I like that. Mr. Hicks, thank you. We have to talk to some of the students who you will see, not just marching and playing instruments, but, of course, keeping the crowd going, waving these beautiful flags. What? every single year when it comes to keeping your energy up, staying positive. What, what about it is it? When we're marching, it's definitely the crowd. For be a little bit rowdy and <laughs> make some messes, but they're really fun. Gotcha, Ashley. Well, Abby, thank you so much. You'll see Abby and the rest of the team right here behind me performing in just a few more minutes. So make sure y'all stay with us. Don't count on me grabbing a flag because these girls know what they're doing and I don't want to embarrass myself. So we'll see about that. For now, reporting live in Mandeville, Leah McNeil, WWL, Louisiana. <laughs> Live. We're talking now our mics open right there. there we're go. talking about just a way to get things started on a Friday morning at the Fountain Blue High School. Also the kid with the side eye there in the no, shot. Literal side eye. Ah. <laughs>